Hey everybody, I'm here today to do a review of this Baby Bjorn Carrier. In this video review, I'll be going over the features and functions of this carrier, telling you about my own personal experiences with the carrier, and also demonstrating how easy it is to put on. So as you can see, there are two portions. There is the strap portion, and there's the actual carrier portion. I'm going to start off with the strap portion. I'm going to show you how easy it is to put on. My son is actually watching me from over there, so if he makes some noises, don't worry about it too much. Alright, so you basically take the strap portion, throw it over your shoulders just like this, make sure that it's nice and straight with regards to the straps. Then you want to take the carrier portion, and it has these two clips on the bottom. So what I like to do is take each clip, put them in place like this. The two clips just like that. Then what you want to do next is you want to take one side, and, and you want to hook it into place, just like that. Hook it in, and it clicks, so it doesn't come out. Now in this position, this is when I would take my son, and what I would put him in the carrier like this. These two spots are for his legs, so I would pick him up, put him in the carrier, get him into position, hold him against my chest, then I would take this side, and then hook it into place, and they're labeled with red and blue, so you can't get them mixed up. Hook it into place, just like that, then his arms would be going through here, so he would be sitting in place, and then you can take these last two clips and you simply clip them in, bam, just like that. There's one, and here is the other. Now, the cool thing about this carrier, in addition to it being awesome in itself, is the fact that if you want to tighten it, you have these straps right here. You can just pull on them to tighten it. It's literally that easy to tighten, okay? Now, there's also this other extra piece down here, which you can adjust according to the weight and the height and on the other side it'll show you the restrictions for each for each section so to take the carrier off you simply undo both of these clips just like this okay then i would undo one of these at this point i would remove my son or i would hold him against me then i would remove the other one okay then I can place my child down, and then you can you have it like this. Now what I like to do sometimes is I just undo one of these. Let's just undo one of them. Let's get my finger in there. Just like that. And you can leave it like this so it stays together. Now on this side over here, I'm actually going to bring this closer to the camera. It shows the, uh, once again, it shows the, uh, the uh, height differences for where you should be, um, you know, going with this, how far this should be tucked in, depending on uh, how tall the child is. I'm sorry, I said weight and height. This is, o this only varies with the height. Now, this uh, carrier is good for 8 to 25 pounds. So that's a big, big, big gap. For the most part, you know, when you would start using this as 8 pounds, a lot of babies are born over 8 pounds, my son was, but even if they're born under 8 pounds, they'll probably get up to past 8 pounds really quickly, and then it's good up until 25 pounds, which is quite a while for most babies. So in my opinion, this is a great carrier. My own personal experience is that my son at first didn't like it too much. He was a little bit fussy when he was in here, but then once he got used to it, I was sort of doing it with him for about five minutes a day. Once he got used to it, he absolutely loves it right now. Loves it right now. But that's basically it. In this video review, I just wanted to go over the features and functions of this Baby Bjorn carrier. I hope that you have enjoyed this video. And that's all I have for you today. <laughs> Thanks for watching.